So one of the really cool things about the Kansas game is that you can see focus starting to come to our offense. Um, we worked almost exclusively on three complementing pieces in this game. Uh, the first is the power running game, and then we also worked on the quick game and the screen game. And those three pieces kind of all fit together with uh, what we're seeing from defenses right now. Um, our power game is kind of complemented by um, our jet sweeps and sort of outside constraints that we're running right now. And what that does is it keeps defenses from really loading the box because they need to be able to adjust to our motion um, at the third level of their defense. Um, so what they're doing instead is trying to bring pressure off the edges and or playing players kind of in this gray area. You can see here Kansas kind of aligns um, one player in the gray area of the box right on the edge and then they eventually bring this corner on a blitz late. Um, so one way to deal with that um, is with the screen game and try to lure them in and then screen behind it. Another way to deal with that is with the quick game um, and work the ball to your wide receivers. Um, just two different ways to deal with the same thing but you need to have more than one response to um, that edge pressure and that allows your power game to continue to be viable. Um, so what we see here from the defense is looks like a quarters look on this side or it could be soft man um, and that's where we're going to work because um, you know with either of those cover it could even actually be cover three uh, cloud here um, with this corner dropping deep and then this safety dropping into this deep zone and this safety taking this deep zone um, so any of those are possible but the common factor with all of them is that this flat should be open as long as you can hold this flat defender uh, on the seam a little bit. And so that's what this uh, route configuration is designed to do. The tight end is going to hold this defender here a little bit longer and then we're going to exploit the flat on a quick out. The important thing there really is execution between the wide receiver and the quarterback. And you can see here um, Ash throws a nice quick pass on a three-step drop and hits Shipley. Easily, easy nine-yard pickup. Um, just watch the mechanics of that from Ash one more time. Um, you can see nice three-step drop and then he gets the ball out quickly. Um, if you're not happy with what you're seeing from Ash in the quick game, uh, you know, based on his progression in the last three games, um, you're just not paying attention because he's made great progress there. Um, he throws a nice ball and he's fairly accurate. Um, so those are really great things for us going forward.